Hey what's up guys my name's Edward and welcome back to The Outdoorsman. I'm here just at my local spot where I've been in like the last two videos um, just for a little chill out fishing session hopefully we catch a few fish. Um, it's nearly two o'clock in the day um, so I'm a bit late but uh, usually this place fishes better in the evening so yeah hopefully we get something anyway to show the video. That last night, me and Max were here, like, um, my float was just acting really funny for ages. Max was like, strike it, strike it, strike it. It's like, no, it's, it's too early. Like, I was mm. thinking it could have been the tension away when it was uh, taking it. So it's just the smallest little road to put the boat float down. So it's anti climax again. <laughs> Jesus Christ, yeah. that's probably about five or six pounds. That's huge. That's how that was, huh? Yeah, that's huge. Where'd you catch that? I don't know. Yeah. Where'd you try it? With them two boys. <laughs> Just down there, was it? No, at the, um, yeah. in between the two steel bridges. Do you know, uh, in the middle of the park? Um, in uh, the castle? No, 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 in the oh, middle the of the, in the middle the of the, the, the river, 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 river. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen big brown trout move there, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I got, I got them on the, um, I got them on the size zero spinner. And uh, then my mate, my mate was using a size one off brand the Catlon spinner, and he got a, uh, he got one just at, at around the same size ten minutes later. You know what I mean? Yeah. And it was like a, and that was a, yeah, like a. <sighs> Black and yellow spinner. I was on the silver, uh, silver mech by zero. Yeah. Mm. That's nice brown and silver. Oh, I actually have this stuff as well. Where is it? Oh, yeah. What's that? Flavor, yeah. Flavor. Oh, no way. See? It just makes a sweet smell off. Yeah, that's another smell of it, huh? Yeah, right. You got a little kid aren't you? Oh, jeez, that's a big dirty knot in this thing. So you're close to the top of that one. There you go. Still close. <laughs> Me and Marcus were using this in Hollow Farm. It's actually working really well. Yeah, I've seen that. You got the, the, the tension on the sea corn. That's all we were catching tension yeah, on. Well, no, I, I, like to, I like to go down myself sometimes. Somebody put up like a bleeding three and a half pound brownie on fish brain yesterday, so he caught it on sweet corn. I was like, sorry, what? I've actually <laughs> caught trail on sweet corn. You said someone got pike and worms as well, didn't yeah, you? Somebody, yeah, another lad I was watching, yeah. Oh, that's your flow has gone there, bro. Mine? Yeah, it just dropped a second. Oh, I was I just about to stop that recording. <laughs> Probably stop now because I started at the camera, as it seems to do. Oh. Yeah, Jan. Oh no! I Get missed it. it. You yeah. missed it. Oh, That's a roach, is it? Oh, nice. Oh, nice size. Yeah. First little fish, I wonder what happened there. Whoa. Something bite that, do you think? Could yeah, be a duck yeah, or something. Yeah. Nice little size, it's actually a road. See, I'm learning. Yeah, yeah, no, this <laughs> one's a road, yeah. it. it was gas every time I started nice. the camera. Oh, it's definitely a road, yeah. yeah it's a road, yeah. an injured one. What way did you take that? <laughs> noise of that. Yeah. Clock. Hopefully now the fishing picks up because he's getting bites. 
and I just landed one, so. But we should catch a good few. I'm hammering the swim with ground bait today. Mm -hmm. Go to our ringer with the tigers, man. They were there. You know, like, you know what I mean? Do you know when they tell you, like, something, and I, like, you're like, are you coming to the shop? And I was like, my float is going. Yeah. And then you're like, are you coming to the shop? And I was like, my float is yeah, going. It's and going. you're like, you coming? Yeah, you coming? Yeah. It's like you've already made my decision yeah. for me. So, have yeah. you like, you know what I mean? Like. Oh. oh yeah, you're on. Will be double up though, because I'm there's plenty of fish feeding around my flow and they're getting bites, so hopefully. Hello. <laughs> yeah, I think that's what they're coming over for. Yeah, I'd say so. <laughs> Turn your back there now for a minute. Hey, good boy. The camera oh, can't see. You oh, you're on, yeah? Yeah, you're on. Oh, you're on, yeah. Um, ah. Nice. Yes. Little perch. Shut the camera. Tiny little baby. Tiny little perch. It's only a baby. Yeah, it's only a baby. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. baby. Yeah. Don't be eating that for the I'm <laughs> I just got a bite and it floats some for like literally probably about three or four seconds it's kind of away with the fairies just in my own little world and uh yeah I don't think that's coming back but uh hopefully I'm wrong and hopefully it's made a decent sized fish judging by the way it took it I'd say it's a roach or a rod it's definitely not a perch perch normally mess around with the with the bait a bit and then take it but hopefully I'm showing you the fish that just bit it now in a couple of minutes well the fishing's just dried up um which you know i'm not really too bothered about it was a last minute decision to kind of come out fishing today uh which really got me through the lockdown to be honest uh like this is this place is about probably about 10 minutes from my house so i probably came here literally every day fishing probably blanked most of those days um because the water was very cool so just going for a walk now and just i know what's around here just, it's a nice walk to be honest um yeah, hopefully later on though we, we do catch some some fish again. I'm hammering to swim with ground bait. Nothing seems to be happening, so we'll just go for a quick walk and we'll get back to it now in a couple of minutes. The fishing didn't really pick up after this, which is a bit of a shame. I did however catch a nice goldy coloured rod, which ended up being my PB, which I was quite happy about. Yeah, yeah, you're on, you're on, you're on. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there we go. Lovely stuff. Pay with them a bit. I thought it was a perch actually when I looked at them first. It's a nice size. Nice size, yeah. Oh, oh he's a slab. He's a slab. He's a slab. Look at that thing. <laughs> <laughs> that is a nice size. Yeah, that's a nice size. Yeah, that's a nice size. 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 First one's full of black spots as well. Yeah, yeah. See this? Scored you? Oh, that, that'll do. My mate is, fancies himself to do a bit of a fucking uh, bear grills. Like, and uh, he's like, no, we're not buying, like, you know, disposable barbecues or this, that, and the other, or camping uh, stoves or anything. Yeah. It's like, he just digs a, digs a pit in the ground and then puts the, you know, the, uh, the, tindery kind of stuff at the bottom and then yeah. the smaller logs and there or smaller sticks and then the bigger ones and all this you know what i mean and uh, and then he just brings a, a a grate like you know what i mean like a steel grate like you'd have in your room yeah. and then just dumps it across the top of the pit after the fire burns out when it's all embers and then just cooks on the top of that like you know what i mean either on a pan or on like a fucking tray or whatever you know? so i'd love to do i don't know if he's would be up for it as well like just like 
go out somewhere like on a boat like do you know, like say Loch Ramer do you know the way there's all those like yeah, um, rent boats out there yeah you can get rent a boat out there but like do you know the way there's all the lake islands now mm. camp out on one of them Be with deadly. no yeah. food no food just a rod aye that's bring food oh fucking rod eat whatever you catch and cans and stuff although you probably get a load of shit from where did you get bike uh. yeah that would do you for the weekend, I suppose. Just, yeah. uh, get, get a few bit of bits of fish in the bushes, just in case, and just pretend we caught them. Yeah, we I caught a mackerel, lads! <laughs> we caught this one, um, Inshore, but mackerel. the camera had to be <laughs> off at the time. <laughs> <laughs> we caught this one from Super Value. Yeah. <laughs> right, uh, that was a successful couple of hours fishing. It's funny the way fishing works sometimes, like, in the last video I spent 12 hours fishing, caught one fish, and I only caught two like this time, but I was there four hours, like I started at two o'clock, it was a random day, I just decided like I'm doing nothing, I'll go out fishing. Uh, got a bit burned I think around the eyes, but uh, look I'll survive, um, I always get sunburned there anyway. But yeah guys, um, really what that was all about was just you know, get out, have a bit of fun, go fishing, it's not always necessary to plan a big fishing trip going wherever it is you know an hour from your house whatever just see what's around uh, your local area you might have a pond and you'd be surprised what's in it even the canals around dublin and what was really nice as well is the two guys i was with uh, dan and gary are subscribers of the channel so it was nice just to kind of you know talk and and see like what they think of the videos what they think i can do to improve what they're thinking of them really so far and just you know get some feedback from subscribers directly um and i really just what that's what i want you know people that subscribe to this channel we're all going to build a community we all love fishing um and that's what we're going to do i do you know i'd love to make more fishing videos with subscribers and things like that so guys make sure that you hit that subscribe button if you enjoyed this video make sure you hit the like button and make sure you hit the notification bell because if you don't hit the notification bell you don't get notified when i upload a video and um oh before we go one more thing giveaway winner is drum roll please do, 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 do. i can't use the other hand because i'm holding my phone jason dunn 080 you just won yourself a kinetic tournament rod which i've used in this video and the last one so hit me up on facebook on the facebook page to claim the prize and yeah, good luck with it. Hopefully you catch some, some nice fish.